Now, Derek Waller is live at St. Luke's Hospital after just hearing from the mayor as well as the commissioner. Derek. Candace, some incredible details we just got from police in that press conference a few minutes ago. Uh, this officer was shot in the chest, and it was actually his bulletproof vest that saved his life. Take a look at this video that we just shot a few minutes ago. It shows Police Commissioner James O'Neill actually holding up that damaged vest in that news conference here at St. Luke's Hospital. The commissioner and Mayor de Blasio visited the seven-year veteran of the NYPD at his bedside this morning. They tell us he is in good spirits, awake, alert and will make a recovery. That's after running into a building for a call about a woman getting harassed and immediately encountering a naked man with a gun. It's odd when we come to the hospital and say, hey, kid, you were lucky. Lucky that he was shot. No, he was lucky that he's a professional police officer, his partner's a professional police officer, and he had that bullet-resistant vest on. Nonetheless, he was struggling and fighting for his life in your life. Seven years on the job, uh, absolutely an example of bravery and strength after what he had been through. And police also just released this picture of the gun they recovered. They say this naked man was holding this nine millimeter handgun at the time of this encounter. What's not clear right now is actually which gun uh, discharged the bullet that shot the officer. Uh, whether it was this friendly fire or did it actually come from the suspect? Uh, the commissioner telling us that is still under investigation. For